And here we have a very interesting question. We are supposed to state the values of z. And z, which is within this log, tells us that z must be bigger than 0 in order for this to be defined. And we are supposed to explain clearly why y, this y over here, is between 0 to 1. First of all, we can see that y is within the log function. So this explains to us that y, y must be bigger than 0. And at the same time, z, which is equal to y squared over 1 minus y, we know that z is supposed to be bigger than 0. So now this tells us that y squared over 1 minus y must be bigger than 0. Since y is bigger than 0 and this must be bigger than 0, we see the numerator here as a positive expression. Since y is bigger than 0, y squared will also be bigger than 0. And if this entire expression here is bigger than 0, this tells me that the denominator here must also be positive. I mean, first of all, the denominator cannot be equal to 0, or else the expression is going to be undefined, and it cannot be negative, or else positive divided by negative will not give you something that is bigger than 0. So with this deduction, we know that 1 minus y must be bigger than 0, a positive number, which means that y must be less than 1. So combine this and this together, this tells me that y must be bigger than 0 and y must be less than 1.